Welcome back to Looks by Steph. So I'm starting off as usual by priming my eyes with my LA Girl Pro Primer. I'm just going to apply that on my lid and my eyebrow and blend that out with a brush and a spoolie for my brows and then apply some of that underneath my eyes as well. Then I'm going to go ahead and fill in my eyebrows with some eyeshadow. Then I'm applying this skin tone colored eye crayon to my lid to act as a sticky base for the eyeshadows that I'm going to apply. So starting off I'm taking the color chopper and I'm going to pat that onto my lids. Then I'm going to take the color Smog and apply that to the outer corner of my lids to add a little bit of emphasis to my eyes. Now I'm going to take the color Garnet and apply that to my crease and apply it kind of heavy because I am going to blend it out later. Then I took a little bit of that color Naked to help blend out the Garnet color. And then I repeated the previous steps just for more emphasis. Then I applied that same eye crayon pencil to the inner corner of my eyes and applied the color YDK onto my inner corners. Then I took the color Sable and applied that to the outer corner of my eyes to add even more emphasis. Then I took Tarte's Brow Mousse in the color Rich Brown and started creating a wing underneath my eyes. Then I went ahead and applied liquid eyeliner to my top lids. And then applied Urban Decay's Black Velvet to my waterline. Then I took the color Espresso and applied it underneath my waterline to add a little more darkness. Then I applied Garnet underneath that. Then I just highlighted my brow bone with a matte vanilla shade. Then I curled my lashes to prep them for my false eyelashes. Then to blend my real lashes with the fake lashes, I'm using Etude's House Volume Cara for my top and bottom lashes. <laughs> 